Hello there, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. So on this video, we're going to talk about Unlock Creative Potential with Prom AI. Complete tutorial. Now for this one, we're currently going to use the free trial for this plan. Anyway, if this is going to be a good one, and then you like me to create a paid version, uh, version of this one, so please comment down below in the description. Anyway, this is going to be the credits. We have 20 credits that is going to be refreshes, 10 coins per month. These are going to be the usage for one image that would be around 2 coins or 1 to 4 coins for each of killer. Now since this is a free trial, let's talk about the pricing first. For the pricing, this is going to be it. This is monthly. Yearly has a 26% off theme and coins. I think they have an option where you can just buy coins individually so you don't have to go for the paid subscription monthly. Actually, that is a very good um, effort for that one. $10 for 200 coins? That's a really good deal. And let's go back on the dashboard. Now what makes this a good AI? On the top section for the AI tools, you're going to have easy and quick access. And there's going to be a preview in each of the tools. For example, for the upscaler, you can see right here. For outpainting, you can see right there. Erase and replace, as you can see right there. Image to video, text to video. And of course, the first one we're going to do today is sketch rendering. In here, you're going to have a wide variety of choices also. It's basically the same as the one from the top section, but this is much more um, descriptive. Much more, let's just say, information for you guys. Now let's get in here for EA Image Generator with this one right here. I'm going to focus first on creating a sketch, generating it, make it look good, and then transforming it into a video. So let's start with this one. You can choose which one you want for the templates. If you can't really can find it, simply type in here, sketch. Click answer, and these are different sketch models that we can use for. Choose the one that it really speaks to you. So for this one, I'm going to go with this one right there. Now this is going to be a sketch, I can download it as it is. Or, I can use this template and click on remix. I'll see you once inside. Now welcome back to the video. Now we're currently using that specific template. Right here, even though it's not really showing, we're back on the basic prom bar. So this is going to be modern architecture sketch. I'm not going to change anything just yet. We have version 1 and version 2 here. Now under version 1, the metrics here, I'm just going to change the style. I'm going to go for a blueprint. And for the scene here, we have architecture, interior, commercial space, landscape, that will be by your own choosing. For architecture, or rather scene, I'm going to go for architecture. I'm going to go for residence building. You can choose a lot more here, but for me, I'm going to go for residence. Now we have a choice for perspective. Now this is going to be by your own preference also. Now for this one, since we're going for a sketch, I'm going to go for aerial view. This one right here. Now you can have the negative prompt there, for example, add in some blurry stuff that you don't want to see. I'm going to add in blurry, pixelated, and noisy. Fix the spelling of noisy right there. Perfect. Now in the below section, we can have ratio, which is basically aspect ratio. You have 1 by 1, 4.5 or 4 by 5, and the works. So I'm going to go with this one since this is going to be a blueprint. I'm going to go for scene by 9 adjust the artistry to give it a little bit more power. And best uh, practice here, I suggest go for 30. Next up, we have lighting here, but since our project is about sketch and building, we don't need it as of now. Fast mode basically gives you uh, skip the queue, but this is for pay subscribers. Take note about that one. And number of images, you have 3. You can reduce it to 2 or 1. I'm going to go for 3. That will cost me 0.3. 3 coins, click answer right there, and I'll see you once it's here. So welcome back to the video. So we have this one since technically this is literally a blueprint with this one right there and basically with that one. Now the problem I see here because we're not having that perspective we're looking for, that output. Let's match this prompt. So this is basically a modern architecture sketch. We can click on this one, enhance prompt to give us a bit more specific. As I always say, the best results comes from a basic and specific prompt. With that being said, we can now click on enter with this one. I'll see you once inside. And welcome back to the video. This is gonna be the new prompt using the enhance option right there. So we have a few more images to work with. And that being said, let's try to render it as of now. I think I'm gonna go with this one. I like it a lot. So I'm gonna simply download it with that option right there. Preview download. You can have full download if you have the paid plan with that one, but since we only have the free plan, we're going to sell it with what we have. Now to get started with this one, go to AI Tools, go to Sketch Rendering with this one. Now this is going to be Sketch Rendering, as you can see right there. It's basically the same process, 
or you can upload the image we have and i'm going with the first one earlier i think this one right here now that being said you can enter a prompt here for example i'm going to type in architecture um sketch now if you're having a hard time making a prompt if you're not having the results you're looking for you can use a reference image but for now i'm satisfied what i have here and then for the styles since this is going to be version 2 now for this one again this is going to be version 2 you can choose whatever you want for your style but for now i'm going to go with the default i'm going to go for realistic the one right there now under steam this is actually a good one it depends on your product for example if you're selling for jewelry if you have different styles for example some clothes you can go here but since this is going to be architecture we can choose a building a residence building right there the building style is going to be here i'm going to go for mid-century modern or nordic functionalism and for the environment you can choose day autumn rain snow or fog i'm gonna go with night so i have three parts right there building type building style and environment now for artistry as best practice early i said for image generation 30 is gonna be the best recommendation right however for this is gonna be render now so please pull up up to 75 that will be my suggestion but again that will be by your own preference now perspective this will play a crucial role also since we're doing buildings i suggest go for aerial bird side top view or drone view i'm gonna go for aerial right there and lighting this would be by your own preference also actually since this is gonna be rendered now it's actually a very crucial part here so of safe being safe here i suggest go for soft natural lighting now right here we have an option for detail basically detailed mode creates longer detailed images but takes longer for this is for subscribers only Anyway, since this is a free trial, we're going to skip those and generate the images right now. I'll say you want it here. Now, welcome back to the video. Like, wow, right? This is going to be the rendered version. We have three, actually. Three versions for you guys. I know there's even a white glimpse there because it's still loading. However, this is going to be the original our sketch. As you can see right there, everything is at the point. Now, imagine if this is still on uh, the paid plan using the detailed version right anyway you can do side by side here by clicking those options right there or the slider you want to check the before and after pretty awesome tool right you can really have your before and after option here so you really know what changes what needs to be done and different more now for example you want to edit this one and prepare it for a video you can simply click on that edit right there you can have a recent replace, out painting, image the video. This is gonna be the last one right there. The GW scaler. So we're gonna utilize a race and replace here. So this is gonna be under erase and replace. Basically, you can have an option to auto select, manual selection, lasso, or the works. For this one, I'm gonna remove these cars here because those two right there are not really working for me. There's a little bit of distortion. Now for that, I can replace, remove, recolor, or retouch that specific area. For example, I want to remove it, I can just simply click that one and then basically generate as of now. So welcome back to the video, that took roughly around 2 minutes, so those vehicles right there are now removed. Perfect, right? Now for this part right here, we're going to utilize Outpainting. Basically, Outpainting can enlarge your image or decrease it. Now for this one, I'm going to decrease it just a little bit to expand this area right there. I'm going to type in here, a wide yard with lush green grass, something like that. I think I'm satisfied with this. Now I can also select generate and I'll see you once it's here. So welcome back to the video. We have three samples here. However, the second one is the only one I want here. So I'm going to preview download then. So I have this on my computer right now. Now since we have successfully expanded it, or reused the outpaint option right there, remove the car. How about let's try right now the scene changer. Because with that being said, we have here, I think this is around on the bottom section, scenario changer. I'm going to click it right now. And right here, I can just simply type in snowy weather. Again, this is going to be the scenario changer. For the styles, I can go for season. I can go for winter. And with that being said, style intensity, I'm going to increase it up to 60. Something like that. And generate images. I'll see you once it's here. And right there, this is going to be the new image. Let me try use the slider. So again, guys, this is the original, right? Again, this is now the new one. Take note, earlier there is no lights or the lights are not really highlighted. But since this is going to be the winter, you can really see the highlighted lights right here. Pretty awesome, right? And that being said, thank you so much for watching. Please hit the like button subscribe. I'll catch you guys on the next one.
Goodbye for now.